Yo yo yo, what is going on guys? It is a man bad place. We're back at you with another video of Cyberpunk. So let's continue where we left off and get my ass in the helicopter. What are you waiting for? Yo, chill out, man. Oh damn. Get us in the air! Like, Here, put this on! And it stays on! Got start, it? Slight start to over there. God damn. The usual. Game slide is still buggy a bit, but eh, it's all good. Getting up, man. I like the style of that, though. Bomb's name is what? Wrap it up! We got a shelter! The Demolitron. We're good to blow. Shotgun Elite income! Run for it! Shoot the cables! Get the rotor spinning! We're on our way! 
Not done yet. Still need to feed this to their subnet. Fucking knew it! This was never about corporate colonialism. This was about your groupie output, wasn't it? No, you wouldn't understand. Giving you four fucking minutes. Chopper's not gonna wait one sec longer. Door lock breached. Narasaka's sons of bitches in power. Love you, Spider. All world loves me. Man down! Take their position! Well, this hitting headshots after headshots, and I shot the shit in there. We've got heavy casualties! Got the. Oh, shit! I didn't expect definitely to get that, but yeah, sure. I don't even have the ammo to see what is actually ammo this one though, so yeah. What's up, man? It says we look at those, bruh. Closing in on the ice. Sweet icebreaker. Foreign, right? Just wonder if we know anyone who can switch the subnet protocol. Hilarious. You gonna help or not? Do spiders spin webs? It's time we caught some flies. Thanks, Murph. Now, just for good measure. Holy cyber cow. We're on TV. Take Can a look. Turn now to Arasaka Tower. It's evacuation ongoing after an unidentified terrorist organization released a manifesto threatening violence. The terrorist stating their desire to, quote unquote, Topple a monument to corporate colonialism. Night City's mayor, Imbole Ebonike, has issued a statement declaring that he will bring the full force of the law to bear in response to any act of terrorism. Going now to our reporter on the scene at Arasaka Tower. Hopefully he can shed some light on the situation as events unfold. All set. Now get out of there. Let's get out of here. They're moving up. Get the roof quick. Associates. Who are they? How did you acquire fistful material? Gonna give good cop over there a chance to say something? Come on. <sighs> Which terrorist organization do you belong to? How did you acquire fistful material? <sighs> I know you. Let's see. Jokes that's how I Hot damn. 
done and gone. My husband died in that tower. But there are fates worse than death. I didn't want him to die. Naze. Why did you do this? To bring an end to the madness, you freak. People What the hell is this? But it's just crazy, man. Fuck up, samurai. We got a city to burn. <laughs> oh man. I'm glitched out. than she looks. Now, listen, dog. I have done exactly what you asked. So let's you and me figure this out. <laughs> You hear 
me. I need your help. Attention. Do you know a Ripadoc whom you can trust? I know someone. We must get to Ripadoc quickly. Victor will fix us up. We have to get there somehow. Call someone. Anyone. You are outside the service area. Bloody hell. Just come pick me up. Need to get to Misty's Esoterica in front of Bix. Of course. A vehicle is en route. It should arrive in less than 20 minutes. What are you doing? Hey! The personal link is damaged. Please proceed to insert the jack below the ear, though not too deep. There should be auxiliary neuro sockets between her lymph nodes, beneath the SCM muscle. If I hit the vein by mistake, she will die. Indeed, as she will if you do nothing. I think I have the socket. Now proceed to connect. Let's get her inside. I cannot hold it. I need to rest. No, you don't. your blood. Misty! You're not gonna die on me too, man. Come on. Pressure's tanking. It's neurogenic shock. She's dying. Gotta cut my way through the occipital bone. No other way. There is risk of... I know what I'm doing.
How is she? Slower on the men than you, but looking better every day. Describe them to me. Blinding lights. It's loud. I'm on stage and almost can't breathe. I'm so damn full of hatred. And then I let it all out into a mic and I realize it didn't help. I don't feel any better. And then I promise not to laugh. I plant a bomb in Arasaka Tower. Nothing there to laugh about. Night City looked different. Strange. And I, I hated it. Hated everybody. Every inch. It was too real. Even for a lucid dream. You weren't dreaming, V. Those were memories. There's a personality construct on that shard. Dreams you had were from his past. Saying I experienced another psyche's memories? How is that even possible? You two are connected in a way I can't make head or tail of. Two? Me and who? Like, who's the other? Johnny Silverhand. Johnny Silverhand. Hell the yeah. Real talk of the town back in my day. <sighs> anyway, that's not what's important right now. What is? The biochip. It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much life. A few weeks tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness, gradually taking over your body until one day you'll just be gone. V, it's important you get all this. You'll fix me up, right, Vic? If I could, I would, V. Believe me. But this is... It's way beyond what I know how to do. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? You want the long story or the short? I have to die. I am going to die. That what you're saying? Prove it. Hmm. Dex shot you, right? The bullet damaged your chip slot and your brain. The biochip revived and short-circuited you. It started uploading data into your head. As far as it was concerned, your brain was an empty vessel that needed to be filled by the engram it was carrying. Empty vessel? But I'm right here. All of this is me. The shard doesn't read, it writes. Headache of yours is the biochip rewiring your neural pathways, building new neural structures, doing away with the old. From where the shard's sitting, you, what's left, is all a tumor that needs to be excised. What was to do, man? You've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then. What the hell do I do? Tell me, please. Vic. I wish I knew, kid. 
Misty. Bloody hell. You're asking too much from an old timer like Vic. Come on, V. Let's get you home. And then he died. And I thought I was gonna die with him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death. The inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. Here, got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudoendotrizine's from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. Gotta lie down. Here. Got one more thing for you. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? Promise you'll try to get some sleep? You're lovely, Misty. Thanks. Good night, V. Sweet, peaceful dreams. Get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way, you included. Whoa. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? Bloody hell. Alright guys, I think I start the video right here, so we'll talk to my man Keanu Reeves soon, see you in the next one.